So my friend Kaoru, we've known each other for a long time. We went to college together. Um, we are both Japanese and we've both worked in entertainment and we just thought that it was a really fun idea to combine our Japanese like love and heritage to kind of explore that as a YouTube series. So please, if you want to see more of um, these kinds of content, of this kind of content, um, please subscribe and like it and say lots of nice things. So our topic for today, uh, Japanese beer comparison. So I didn't even know that there were the, this many different types Actually, of Japanese. Actually, there are more. There are way more than this. These are the most accessible in the United States. Oh, really? Yeah. Where'd you get them from? Uh, Vedmo. Vedmo? Well, I was going to go to a Japanese <laughs> store, but then not a lot of people in middle America wouldn't have access to that kind of ethnic store anyway. So our demographic is middle America. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently. Well, I'm sure there are a lot of places you can get, you know, Japanese yeah. beer like Ranch 99, Mitsuwa, Nijiya, all the chain grocery store. Mm -hmm. But then, so is our job to drink all of every single one of these? Yeah, then just to hang out with us, right? Okay, it's gonna yeah. be interesting to see how this progresses. Mm -hmm. as we drink it. And I know you said that I don't have to drink all of my portion. But oh, you do. <laughs> so by toward the end, it'll be a, a, a little like a drunken now. history <laughs> yeah. show. Asahi Dry. Asahi Dry. Uh, well, what, why are there two different ones? Two so different asahi. that's way karakuchi means. I think it's drier. This is karakuchi. What's this? What's this one? Just super dry. Oh, this what's is the probably difference? Super super dry. Probably. What does dry <laughs> even mean in beer? Asahi Super Dry was a direct result of an extensive market research which indicated a consumer preference for a more palatable beer with a less maltiness, relatively this high alcohol content, like this? and a light aftertaste. <laughs> so, is, is this that's you too? <laughs> You know, I don't really have like a way to compare. <laughs> well, we only <laughs> drank one. What am I supposed to compare it to? Just but it's very like light. light. Like it's not so much. I don't know. It just tastes like beer. I feel like I'll be able to compare it to this guy. Uh, we're gonna drink this big boy, right? Yeah, karakuchi. All right, kanpai. Kanpai. Oh. <laughs> it's Maybe. like more bitter. There's more, um, I think it's more malty. No? I don't know what malty. Have you yeah. ever had like malt shakes? Is that the same thing as malt beer? I, I believe so. No. no? The malt? Is malt in beer the malt same as malt? Malt is a barley, um, like a sugar content of barley, I think. That's what is fermented in alcohol. I think so, but um, it's definitely like a stronger taste. It's not as smooth for is. me. No, I like it. It's, oh, you like it? You like, I, I like it. You prefer it over the other one? I like mm, the other one. The other one would be better when you're eating, I think. Well, they, both of oh. these are good with food. After this, why would you? <laughs> You're not gonna get that. Thank you. It's the nicest thing you've ever done. So I think you're gonna get Oh my god. <laughs> there she is. That's my friend. Oh. Okay, next one. Okay, Sephora. can you hold it up? Yep. Yes, right. yes ma'am. No, you don't know have to. Actually, closer <laughs> the better because this is your focal length. Okay, my focal length. <laughs> this is Sapporo Premium Beer. Okay, Sapporo, Sapporo Premium. Premium. Ah, it's interesting. It's tastes definitely like different. Water. <laughs> tastes what? like nothing. Really? Yeah. 
tastes like fizzy water with the aftertaste. Yeah, it's, it it has more aftertaste than asahi, but like not in a good way. Really? It's not my like a hoppy, more hoppy. I wish it was more anything. It's just really bland. How are you seeing it? Um, I feel okay. I feel like we're playing beer pong. <laughs> I think so. The yeah. That's the speed at which this beer is being consumed. I feel alright. How do you feel? You look <laughs> like you feel fine. I feel grateful <laughs> that we are friends. <laughs> hey, next, next up. Next up, hi Kirin Ichiban. First press, 100% malt. There's, it's malty, like you said. 100% malt. Well, because beer is made of water, <laughs> yes. barley, uh, malt, and well, let's see. yeast, right? Yeast? Yeah. <laughs> you said yeast. Yeast. <laughs> Does it have the ingredients in here? No. How much the alcohol content? Man, this was made in Los Angeles. <laughs> That's disappointing. <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah, is dude, it, it says right here, brewed under supervision by Anheuser-Busch in Los Angeles, California. <laughs> oh, man. This is ruining the premise. 5% alcohol. Please recycle. We will recycle, thank you. I'm probably gonna cry. Ooh. This one's, why is it way more bubbly? Like foamy. It's got the 100% mold. Maybe. Yeah, it's creamier, right? <laughs> I don't know if I want to describe anything as creamier. Like a more of a um, milder on your tongue. <laughs> I'm trying over here. Help me out, please. <laughs> um, I don't mind this one. It's better than the Sapporo. The Sapporo is my least favorite. I think so far the, the, either of the Asahis are more of my favorite. This one's okay. This one's like clean. The only one that tasted that much different is the Karakuchi Asahi beer. That was like way more bitter. Yeah. But I, the other ones are pretty... I mean, it's not like one's like that much more different than the other. This one just seemed a little bit more like foamy to me. The Japanese beer, I like it better like like namabiru, like when you're pouring it from the top, mm -hmm. that's delicious. Uh, I don't know how it, it tastes different. I think it's different because of the water. All, all Japanese beer except three kinds are namabiru. Namabiru is ne imi nani? Nama is like, it's kind of like um, milk in the United States. It, you know, because these are... It's what, milk? Yeah, these are like fermented, right? Mm -hmm. So it has to be pasteurized to stop the further fermentation mm -hmm. by heat. Mm -hmm. But nowadays, they don't even do the heating process anymore. So namabiru means it's not It's like un, un, unheated, mm -hmm. unpasteurized. Well, it's delicious. Namabiru is delicious. But it's all of the um, beer, except for classic lager or namabiru. Woo! Okay. Okay, this is Sapporo Reserve Beer, and it's uh, a product of Vietnam. So not nothing from is California. Japanese. No, nothing Same. is Japanese. <laughs> this is all a lie. Okay, it says crafted with select barley malt and hops to create a full-bodied lager. I don't like that word. What does that even mean? Lager? Yeah. Give me a moment. Let's Google that. Do you know what that means? Lager? Why didn't you correct me this whole time? Hi. Ooh, I like this can. It's very, <laughs> I shouldn't hold it like that. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Why? It reminds you of something? It's very sturdy. <laughs> <laughs> I like the color of this beer. It's, it's darker, huh? Yeah. It, it looks, looks more like, like what beer should look like. Mm -hmm. it's Kampai. Kampai. I like it. I'm so tipsy right now. Are you really? <laughs> My heart is pounding. <laughs> I like it.
like this one. Yeah, I kind of, I, like I kind of knew that I was gonna like it just because I like this marketing. Yeah, and I think it, it's working because, but before even we opened it, I we was felt very special. attracted. Yeah, to right. This beer. And it's a reserve. It's like a Starbucks yeah. reserve. It's, it has to be special, so it was already in my head. Yeah. Pro tip, if you are drinking and you do get Asian glow, which is a real thing, do like an anti-acid. Like, a, like I took you a little drunk right now. Oh my god. Like I I take like Pepsi AC or just like anything basic. Yeah, anything that has hamochi in uh, it. What? What was that? How would you pronounce that in English? Uh, well, actually, I don't know. Promotidine? Promotidine? Yeah, it sounds like it. Yeah, I don't know. But if you get anything that's like an antiacid, yeah, promoting 20 grams, 20 milligrams, uh, an hour before you start drinking. An you hour, just, yeah. Yeah, you're supposed to be an hour. To not get as red, but it's not, it's not the best thing you could do to your health, though. Really? No. Why? Does it affect your I mean, health? Any any antacid or acid blocker <laughs> or painkiller or anything. Well, I'm very holistic and hit me. So. <laughs> don't, don't do it because anything that inhibits your natural body function. Oh boy, here we go. Ain't no good. Odeon. I've never even Odeon. It's, it's heard like, about this. It's beer. like a very local beer in Okinawa. Mm. Yeah. Have you been to Okinawa? I would love to go to Okinawa. I've been to many, many different parts of the world, random places, but not Okinawa. Mm -hmm. I do not like this color. It looks like soda. <laughs> Premium draft beer. It says clear, mild taste. Oh. It's actually from Okinawa. It is. Yeah. How this is the only beer that's actually from Japan. <laughs> How much is our alcohol content? 5%. So this is the only real Japanese beer that we're having today. <laughs> Do not drive car or operate machinery. <laughs> it's a Japanese rice lager. Lager, I think. Pale Maybe. yellow. Okay. Yeah. Come by. Come by. Oh, it's. Kind of fruity, you know? A little bit. It's good. It's I like good. it. I like it a lot. I think this is like a female of a beer, if as opposed to a man. I feel. What does that even mean? Masculine and feminine energy. I do not feel any. I'm. I feel non-binary energy. Okay. We're feel, 2019 now. You can't put labels on shit. <laughs> <laughs> the world is made of yin and yang. There's always a feminine and masculine energy, regardless of gender. I don't. I but this don't is agree. more of a. This is a, a softer, milder, fruitier. I don't see that at all. Or maybe I'm just too buzzed to understand. It. I think so. It's it's very mild, and it does. But so are these. It's not. It's not as malty. It's not malty at all. It just seems like well. But, it doesn't like pitch itself to be malty. But it's. Yeah, it's way. It tastes way different. It's more. It does taste more like rice. Yeah, it to does. be honest. Yeah. Because it doesn't have that much kick to it. No, there's no kick at all. So, which one's your favorite? Mm. You know what? Actually, if I was at work. Mm -hmm. Why are with you working at people? work? <laughs> no, like, it, <laughs> if I was drinking with like a business setting, mm -hmm. I might go with this. Yeah. But then if I was on a date, I might want to drink this. Those two are my favorite too. Yes. But I did like the maltiness of these two. I don't like any of the ones in the middle. I like this one. And I like this one. Oh, you can't see this shit. These, so are, these are the top two. Yep. These are our faves. Holler at us, basically. Let it <laughs> <laughs> Take the, well, let me. Okay, you got a clean cut. Okay, okay. all right. Oh, go, so. go. Oh, hold on, hold on. 
<laughs> Let us know what you thought of this video and if you have any products or Japanese drinks or beer that you could suggest that we could try, uh, please comment below and do you have anything to add? Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching.